good morning, afternoon or evening and welcome to the Quilts and Cats of Calico where we need to win a quilting match against our father here who we met in our previous episode. Okay, so we've got a cat who needs seven plus of uh, either of these ones connected to each other. Six plus of uh, polka dots or ferns or uh, five of these stripes or, or these in this kind of formation. Let's see what we can do. The uh, 7 plus might be a bit of a stretch, but uh, maybe I can uh, do the 6 plus. Uh, we'll see. Uh, these are all pretty challenging. This one because of the formation. I mean, um, it probably won't be too difficult to get five tiles of the same pattern, but uh, they need to be in that specific formation, so... Let's see, do we have a place here where we've already got kind of like the stripes and that? Uh... Where do we have stripes? No, we don't have a place like that. Or at least I'm not seeing it. So... Yeah, well, we'll see what we can do with the cats. For now, um, let's see. So, uh, these ones need to be the 7 plus in any kind of uh, formation. I'm just kind of wondering. We've got this one where we need three of a kind anyway. And then we've got one, so then we'd have like two, three, four, five, six, seven. We could try something like that. So in that case, this would go here. Yeah, I think so. So, I'll put this here. And then, what do we want? Uh, let's see, stripes need to be in that kind of a formation. Mm, I could try that over here. So, like, three stripes. And then, two... Oh, Oh, but we've got that there. No, 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 no. This needs to be stripes as well. So we can't have it here because we need to have... All of these need to be different. Right. So, um... Let's see, we could try for it like here. So if I was to like put the purple stripes here, that could work. Like this, and we'd have one of the patterns surrounding this B stripes. I guess I could Try that. So, burns. 
ferns. Let's see, ferns, six plus in any kind of formation. And uh, where do we have ferns? There, there. Uh, is this? I think this is a fern. And then here. If these go like this, then we can't use this fern. But we could go from here to here. Or rather from here like like this because um, we can't have two ferns. So that fern would go here then. I think I'll grab it and do that. We'll see. Obviously. Uh, this fern would go here. And then, uh, yeah, that these stripes here. And I guess I'll grab the polka dots. So these stripes here. And then I'll grab that. Ooh, we've got a lot of stripes. Uh, so let's see. Where, um... Where do we want to put the polka dots? Um... I'm not going to mind uh, or like care about the 6 plus thing here. If I am going for the six plus with the ferns. So the ferns are going here. And then polka dots could go here or here or here. I think if I want to go for the light blue, no, but this would be good for the yellow. Um. I guess if I put the polka dots here and then um, I'll try and see if I can get light blue that one here so I could get the light blue button here And the yellow button would go here. And then... I guess I could try for the dark blue here. So, um... This is where I'd put these then. I'm just trying to think carefully here and make sure I'm not making a mess of this but uh yeah i think it works and then i need stripes for here so um i guess i could put the green stripes like here and then we could try for like a green button I guess the green stripes could go here as well like whichever and then um I could see about getting a pink button over here if I put the green 
like here or here. So that would mean over here would mean getting to green uh, stripes because this is going to have to be a striped one as well. Well, I think I am going to take the stripe, the green stripes anyway. We'd need that kind of a thing. I'm just thinking if I put this here and I guess I could see about, but no, um, no, I can't because I'm going for the ferns here. Right. So it doesn't really matter which one. Mm. Does it? I guess not. Mm. I'll put this here. And then we need a pink. What does it need to be? Pink. Uh, a pink one of these here. Right. So I guess I want the stripes. Or I mean, this would have been great too. Uh, let's see. Trying to be smart about this. Uh, here. With that. And, uh, do I want to grab the yellow stripes? Hmm. Or do I want to grab these? Because. Because I do need these as well. Over here. I guess I could grab that. Okay, dark blue. I'm kind of tempted to put this here and get the green button, but then I won't necessarily get the, the 7 plus here. 7 plus is already a lot. Um, so yeah. I guess I'll put this here and then I'll grab that ooh I need that good for me I'm I'm getting this one done already mm. so this needs to go here Yeah. And I guess I could get the green polka dots to put here. Right? Get the green button. Yes. But this is more important. This here. Great. So, um, 
I guess I could go for the dark blue button over here. Or, sorry, the light blue button over here instead of here. That way I could maybe go for the dark blue one here. So I'll grab that. Ooh, light blue. Okay, okay. So I guess I'm putting this here. And then <laughs> we'll see whether this is going to end up being green or yellow or or dark blue. Um And let's grab that. Alright, so I'm putting this here and then I'll get the cat. And the light blue button. And uh, need one stripe here and I've already got... So I guess I could go for the purple button here. Hmm. And then surrounding this here. Um, no more of these patterns or like no more of this pattern. One more green or light blue. So I guess I'm getting the green so I can get the green button here. Yes. So I'll put the green here. And then the stripes. I guess I could go for a pink button over here as well. So let's see, I've got green, I've got light blue. This could be yellow. And then if I put the um, dark blue stripes here, this could be dark blue. Right. And then purple stripes here, and then either one of these could be purple. And uh, we'll get the purple button. So I'll grab that. Okay. Uh, right. So, yeah, dark blue stripes here. And then this doesn't work for over here because we need it to be not one of these and not polka dots either. Over here, hmm. It would work because we've got one pattern here. No, it actually wouldn't work. It's got to go here. So if I put the purple stripes here, I'm going to have to have purple stripes here too because we need like this shape of stripes. Hmm, because you can only have two of a kind max uh, in these tiles surrounding this one. If I put the purple stripes here, but I could put them here and then some other... 
either another color of stripes or purple stripes here. But then I wouldn't get the purple button. Hmm. What do I want to do here? Hmm. Well, I guess I'm going for the dark blue button over here. So, um, I'll get that. And I think I'll get the yellow button with this. We've got some ferns for over here now. Um, let's see. I guess I'll put the yellow here. So, about those ferns. Um, I've already got the dark blue button here, and I've already got a green one too, so I don't really need either one of those here. Does it matter? Let's see. Um, I guess it is extra points if I get more than one button of a color. I still need the purple button and the pink button though. So I guess maybe I'll try to get a pink fern over here. And then these can be the uh, dark blue and the green. Right, and then the colors surrounding this one would be green and dark blue. So does it matter? I guess I might want to put the green here. Oh, okay then. I guess I'm I'm uh, getting the purple. Uh, let's see. I could. Hmm. Where do I want to put the purple? I guess I could put the purple here actually, or the purple button. And then, if I'm not going for a purple button here, um, I guess it would make sense to put the purple stripes here to complete this. And just some kind of a stripe here. Right? Yes. And, uh, let's see. So, I want to take the purple fern. And, uh, put it here. That's, oh. That's already too purple surrounding this. Well, I mean, I guess this could be a purple. Yeah. And then these could be pink. So I'd need two pink ferns. Oh, this is getting complicated. Well, I mean, I guess it isn't really such a big deal if I don't get the rainbow button. Let's just, um... What if I put the purple fern here? That 
would make a purple button. I just have to get another purple fern. And then one pink fern here and... No, but that doesn't work because... I can get... Mm, a maximum of two at a... Two of a kind surrounding this one. And that includes colors and patterns. So... What's the smartest thing to do with the ferns here, then? Um... It would be smart to make this one a purple. But I don't know how many ferns I'm going to get here. Um, it would be 9 points to get the ferns completed here. Mm. I guess I'm just going to abandon the idea of getting a rainbow button. Yeah, that's... that's what I'm going to have to do. A shame, but, uh, that's how it's gonna be. Um... Let's see... Oh, I guess it it's time to end my turn. Right. Oops. Sorry, I got a, a bit ahead of myself. So there's that stripe I need for here to get the nine points for almond. So I guess this is going to be a light blue stripe then. And... Um, I guess I could get another green button over here if I put the this here. And uh, then this fern would... Well, let's get this. And this fern... Oh. I guess I have to grab something. Uh, so four over here. I don't want it to be a fern. And I don't want it to be a stripe. And I don't want it to be one of these. So I guess... I could... And this is going to be a purple fern here. So, I guess I could grab this or this. Doesn't really matter which one. Pink fern. Oh. Well, at least it's a fern. It's too bad that I can't get both the uh, purple and the pink button here. I guess I'll put this... Ah. Uh, I guess I'll put this here. And get the pink fern. And then I'll put the pink fern here. To get the cat. And uh, let's see, I've got two pinks. And if I put this here, I'll also have two of these. Yeah, that'll work. Right. 
So I just want to grab one for here and that'll obviously be the pink. So I'll get the button. So let's complete that. And then <laughs> I guess I get to choose whether I want a purple button or a pink button. So do I go for the purple or for the pink? The pattern is the same on both. I guess I'll go for the pink. No rainbow button, unfortunately. But uh, I think I did win. So that's good. These cats, a clouder of cats. I haven't felt this safe in so long, so blissful. Forgive me, I left you all for so long. For so long I've been terribly in the wrong. This remarkable power that rests within you, these cats, together, you've given me hope. It's time to put an end to this senseless war. I know there must be a solution. Come with me to the general. It's time to end this war. That day became known in the free city of Tom Kitty as the turning point for the whole kingdom of, of Scratchington. The Tom Kitty General met with the head engineer from the factory and they talked for a long time. When they finished, the General marched to the borders with a proposition for a truce. While the engineer designed a machine that would forever resolve the conflict that had been tearing both kingdoms apart for years, a machine for soil fertilization. Oh, okay. During the feline festival, everyone came to Tom Kitty. Everyone who came to Tom Kitty did everything for the cat's blessing to support the fight for peace. Performances, music, treat eating and cat petting went on non-stop for the whole week. The cats not only granted the wish for a truce, but also rewarded the citizens of Tom Kitty. Rita put on her play during the feline festival. She received a standing ovation and the talk of her work lasted long after the premiere. The cats inspired her to create more plays and soon she became known in the whole kingdom of Scratchington and beyond. General Joseph retired and finally returned to Viviane, whose health improved significantly. Both went back to doing what they loved the most, Viviane to singing and Joseph to tending his rose garden, but most importantly, to each other. What happened to Omi? During the feline festival, Aunt Agatha called on Omi for her hermitage. However, it turned out that Omi vanished as if into thin air. The only thing Omi left was a note. Meow the, for Meow the force be with you. 
no one has seen her again. Gustav resigned from the army and became a private investigator. Thanks to him, the people of Tom Kitty now feel even safer. Also, he finally made peace with Edward. Edward, together with Frank, opened their own men's fashion boutique. Edward wanted to design unique pieces made from the heart, and Frank had a taste for beauty and style. Together, they made a great duo and became so popular that they even started to dress the royal family. They also designed tasteful cat pants. The trader, Flora, finally rebuilt her business. It went so well that she opened up her own little shop. She also partnered with Greta the Shepherdess, who provided her with sheep milk, cheese and wool. Billy finally stopped having an empty belly. As it turned out, he was quite an acrobat. During the feline festival, the leader of the biggest circus in Tom Kitty noticed him and offered him a position on his team. Now, Billy has solo performances that draw crowds at the circus. Dina and Mona remained in the factory as senior engineers. They helped the head engineer with the construction of the machine that ended the war. Then, they elevated their skills by making other technologies that helped people. Their biggest accomplishment was in prosthetics, which was very much needed in the post-war times. What about you? After long talks about the difficult past with your father, you made up. Your father decided to go back to quilting. Together, you set up a thriving shop where you made quilts. You're always there when somebody needs your needle and thread. Who became the head engineer? Well, after a lot of convincing, I, Matthew, became the head engineer. Surprise! I've been watching your journey this whole time, kiddo. Or maybe it was the cats that told me your story. To make Tom Kitty as great as before the war, we have a lot of work ahead of us. But the cats are with us. Cats that have power. The future looks fluffy. <laughs> Wonderful job, my dear. Not only did you manage to save the kingdom of Scratchington, but you also find, found your father. This doesn't have to be the end of your adventures, though. Some of the Tom Kitty citizens still need your help. If you have time, visit them in various parts of the city. Okay, I guess we could do that. Um in the coming episodes kind of um see everybody one last time and uh and that way have a, a satisfying end to this let's play series i think i'd like that do one last thing for everybody um, whatever request they, uh, they have for us. So we'll start that in the next episode. The story is already done, but, uh, as I said, it would be very satisfying to complete one last request for every person who we've met during our, um, path through the story. So yeah, um, we'll start doing that in the next episode and, uh, and that'll probably take a few more episodes before we're done with everyone. 
But uh, yeah, that was a nice little story about finding our father and ending the war and uh, and becoming a cat whisperer as well, I guess, and uh, and finding out about the factory and the iron loom and and everything. It was nice. And uh, I am very much enjoying the puzzles and the quilting matches. So uh, yeah, absolutely I will be continuing this series for a little while longer and uh, doing everybody that one last favor or completing that one last request for everyone. For now though. Thank you so much for watching and spending a little of your time with me here today. It was lovely to have you. Please remember to be kind to yourself. Have a lovely rest of your day. And I will see you again next time.